Now, James McLean had a big impact for the Republic of Ireland this evening when he was winning his 100th cap, and he's been speaking with Tony. James, a very special evening for you, your family, and for Ireland. How does it feel? Oh, it was incredible. Like, obviously, that moment beforehand uh, with my family on the pitch uh, and then the reception I got uh, off the crowd was obviously made that little extra, extra bit special. So, yeah, look, they top it off with a one and they, they, they kept in my country. I mean, it couldn't have meant any better, really. And the President of Ireland presenting you with your 100th cap? Yeah, like, it's, you know, it's, it is stuff of dreams. Like, it's cliche, but it's, it's a stuff of dreams. You know, you, you dream up. You come up dreaming of representing your country, and the reality of that happens. You know the chances are are, are very very slim. So um, to do it once is obviously extra special, but to do it a hundred times and then, get, like you said, get presented of the president and uh, the president of the, the the association as well. Yeah, look, it was uh, a special special night. You spoke to me yesterday though about what was needed from from the squad tonight. Uh, I guess a, a response to how poor Friday was. And it took until the second half, but it did come. No, of course. Like, uh, like I, I said just in the media, you know, we have a tendency here to jump to conclusions, and especially when it's a negative. You know, we are only two games in, three now after tonight. So, look, we still have uh, that game against Greece at home. You know, we, we have to win that. We still got the Dutch to play twice, France away, like and uh, Gibraltar. There's a lot of games to play. Points are going to be taken off each other. We just need to make sure we get the, the least taken off us. You interjected on behalf of your manager yesterday. Did you feel a sense that you were playing for Stephen Kenny tonight as well? Of course. Like We're all in this together. Uh, ideally, we'd love to have the media on our side as well, but a positivity uh, you know, would help, especially with a young squad. But look, listen, at half time, there's a bit, of, a bit of nerves going to the game, a bit of anxiety because we knew we needed to bunch back on Friday. And these young lads, they could have crumbled second half, but they didn't. Like they showed quality, we got the goals, and then we were very comfortable in the end. Of. And two assists and your 100 cap for, for James McLean, and you could have scored as well. Yeah, um, like it's obviously nice. They they helped the team, and you know it was a great block by the by the lad. They denied me the the, the the perfect the perfect moment, but look, it's uh, again we're, we're going back to cliches here. It's, it's it's about the team, and I said the team that in in the, in the huddle tonight, you know. Uh, they create something special. Uh, it has to begin somewhere, and let's make sure it's it's the first step tonight on and uh, hopefully qualifying for for Germany. Okay. Thanks, Tony. Thank you.